I'm Tony Harper and I'm Head of Research and Advanced Engineering at Jaguar Land Rover. Well this is the fifth uh, low carbon vehicle event uh, now uh, and since its inception it's been the only significant event that's brought together all of the people that are involved in low carbon vehicle R&D and it's grown to be one of the key things in the key events in the calendar now uh, uh, and now it's in its, in its, in its fifth year it's a, it's a must attend event for all of those uh, that are involved in this space. We're one of the biggest uh, um, uh, investors in, in, in research and innovation in the UK, full stop actually. We're certainly one of the biggest investors in research and innovation in, in automotive and a fair amount of that is in low, is in low carbon automotive. So, so for us we want to show everybody, all the stakeholders here including government, TSB etc, uh, where we are and what we've been doing with our, with our investment. It's also important for us to get a get a check on where where all of the whether everybody else is, where the suppliers are, uh, where the universities are, where all the other stakeholders are, and that kind of happens, you know, once a year at this point in time. So this is a great opportunity for us to present uh, our our ideas on innovation in low carbon vehicles because we we, we invest an awful lot of money uh, in in this. We're the biggest investor in the UK uh, in in this space, and every year we need to show what we've been doing with our investment, with our with our uh, uh, our, our collaboration projects with the TSB. Well, we have a we have a number of TSB projects actually. Some of them are partnerships with Ricardo over over there. The biggest one by far is the Revolution project here, which is a. Uh, uh, very many million pound project. I think it's the biggest single project in the, 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 low, the, the low carbon IDP um, has funded so far. It involves as OEMs, it involves ourselves, Nissan uh, and, and, and Lotus and clearly with that, that public and private investment it's important that we're accountable for that and we show, show everybody where we are with that programme. Well, I think the, the interesting thing is that, that before uh, 2007, when, when the TSB was kind of formed and, and, and promoted uh, these, kind of, these kind of programs, none of that cooperation happened at all. It was almost unthinkable that ourselves and Nissan and Lotus as OEMs would, would cooperate uh, in, in, the, in this space. Um, the, the, the establishment of the TSB and the IDP programs and the general will of the UK OEMs to cooperate on technology and drive that forward for the benefit for their benefit and the benefit of the UK is something that's only really happened in the last last five years and it's it's hugely significant and uh, and is a is a good pointer to where we're all going in the future. I think it, I think LCV contributes to, towards that. Um, we're all thinking about what we do next in this space. So seeing where everybody else is, seeing where, what p potential collaborators and uh, consortium members of the future might be there, and what technologies they have. This is our one point in time during the year to get a to get a check on that, uh, and and for the for those ideas to be uh, the seeds of those ideas to be sown uh, that might form those collaborations in future. I think particularly for, uh, for, for overseas manufacturers, I, I, I'd say it's, it's well worth coming to this event to see where the UK is at and where, and where, it's, and where, it's, where, it's, where it's going. There's great, there's, there's great small companies here, there's great universities, there's great uh, niche technologies that maybe they wouldn't see where, where, they, where they are. And I think it would be a great idea for them, for them to come, come here and also see the enthusiasm of the likes of us. Um, uh, for collaborating and, 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 uh, and, and working with partners in the UK. And I think uh, once they see that, uh, it, would, it, would, it would be a great incentive for them to, to join in.